I'm here to explain to you how I'm getting more RPMs out of my cooling fans. Instead of wiring it into your receiver, your best bet is I'm wiring it directly to the battery, but without messing up the system, I went ahead and just got an extra male adapter and female adapter with the extra wire, wired the two together with the cooling fans. This way you're getting more RPMs out of it than if you would with your receiver. You can hear them humming. And what I did is I just took the heat sink off of this set here and then I just went ahead and zip tied it directly to the heat sink on the ESC. Uh, that was my opinion. I really like it. Opinions like a butthole. Everybody has one. I like this one. Um, if you need to, you can go ahead and just disconnect the two and you can go ahead and put it back to your regular position if you're needing to. That is really loud. And uh, this way, if you want to, and you can take the fans out, if you're wanting to do any bashing in the water, cut the zip tie, that'll go ahead and remove very easy. You want to go ahead and get it wet in the mud or whatnot. But anyways, this is a really good setup. You really get great RPMs out of the system this way. Uh, that way you go ahead and you can eliminate anything if you have it transferred into your uh, receiver box here. But um, I would go ahead and check that out. Anyone that's running some 3S or whatnot, even with the 2, like I said, it's actually great to do it this way. You get some really good runs out of it and good response with your motor. Alrighty, till then.